Well, hello guys, it's Lego Show TV here with a kind of controversy. And I'm just wondering, who do you think this new Ninjago guy is um, in episode 29? Um, it, there's this guy working for um, the Overlord, and he looks like he could be an old enemy of, our, of Ninjago. And as you see... There are different pictures from Ninjago flashing here. And um, that's because I believe that everyone that I talk to who have seen episode 29 in a different language thinks it's Pythor. Now I want to um, just speculate on this. That is just weird. Now look at this picture right here. You'll see more clips at the end, but look right here. The guy in the white suit. We think he's Pythor because his body is not that of a normal human. And episode 29 premieres in English on April 16th at 5.30 Central Time and um, 6.30 Central Time and 5.30 the other time. And I thought that the Great Devourer not only um, swallowed up Sensei Wu but Pythor. But I was going back and looking at um, this, and I'm starting to change my mind. Um, and by the way, I own none of these pictures. All of them by Google. And, um, I was just starting to think, is Python alive? If so, why has he not said anything? Um, how did he escape? Did he run away from the Great Devourer after it ate since he like we saw all saw two, three years ago when the Snake series first started. Was he really meant to be eaten by the Great Devourer? And there's one thing I might say. When the Great Devourer ate Sensei Wu, and if it did manage to eat Pythor, when it when it exploded, did not only did Sensei Wu get out, or did did Pythor get out as well? I have no idea, but I'm just starting to think that because it perfectly makes sense. If Pythor survived, if Pythor didn't survive, how did um, Sensei Wu do survive? And if you need to um, pause and look at the pictures more clearly of the mystery white guy, look, go on and do that. Um, uh, as we're getting close to the end of this five minute segment news story, um, I'm just um, kind of really excited for this. But does this mean that he'll try to do. I know this is goofy, but do you think he'll try to um, release the Great Devourer? If so, everything that the ninjas did for that part is just a waste of complete time. Or is he working for the Overlord? What is it? I guess we are not meant to find out right now because it is not April 16th. It ain't even April yet, and I'm speculating on this. But, um, who knows? Um, it may be some new guy. And if it is, that's great. If it isn't, then we're Ninjago's in trouble. Um, and, it, and to look at better pictures, Paul's, I have to go now. And so, um, thank you for joining me. And, um, um, so please comment and put your ideas and theories inside. I do not own any of these pictures and all pictures go to Google. Um, so yeah. Just look at these pictures, pause if you need to. Um, I know I said I had to go, but um, just look at them clearly. Just pause if you have to. Um, tell me what you think. And uh, I'll see you very soon. I mean, um, I'm very excited. I've been waiting three or four months for this to happen. Two or three since January 27th, when the first two episodes of season three of Ninjago aired. They, air again on April 16th. So see you next